know, the South could choose in less than six months to become independent. And if they do, uh, they'll not only be the newest state on the continent, but they'll be a state with a lot of challenges. And, uh, and some people say they'll be a failed state. I don't think that they'll be a failed state. But what I do think is that we have to redouble our efforts to make sure it's not. Uh, there are many things that go against uh, success in the region but they're, uh, of this state. But I believe firmly in my heart that if we all work together, and the SPLM works uh, with the international community, and most especially with the NCP in the North, then they have a good chance. And I would say that this is what we're trying to do, is to establish a relationship between the SPLM and the NCP that will survive beyond the decision to be independent. Because much of the infrastructure is still linked to the North. And a lot of these issues that I talked about, the transition may take a little while to be successful. And in my view, having a relationship where the future is attractive, that's the most important thing. Because the North and the South are going to continue to have the longest border that they share with any nation. 1,900 miles. And in my view, we can't afford a Berlin Wall or a conflict or, or things that would separate artificially uh, these folks. Yes, they can be independent, but they are still dependent on each other in many ways. And we need to recognize this and work agreements where oil can be flowing for years to come, where communications infrastructure will exist for years to come. And yes, it's important to build those linkages to the EGAD countries to the south, but it's going to take some time to build railroads and roads and communication infrastructure to allow that to happen. So we need to be thinking about the long term. And that's why averting violence and thinking about the long term and what, that what those countries need to look like in 2015 and working a path to get us there as opposed to being focused on tomorrow. Uh, let's take a long view, and that's what I'm trying to do. Mm -hmm.